Well, hello everybody. This is this is my first video on this channel. I am my name is Matthew and I about a year and a half ago I decided that I wanted to do a graphic novel. I'll explain in another video exactly why I decided to do that all of a sudden. Um once upon a time in the past I really liked drawing. I really liked getting into the nuts and bolts of it. I'm more of a realist than I am a comic artist, but eh, you know how that goes. So I just so but the thing is is that I decided because I, I like using Photoshop for a lot of different things. And I had a tablet that was hooked to a Windows tablet or a Windows uh computer and that tablet was okay but I could never really get used to it and I was I was always fascinated with the idea of being able to draw on a screen. So whenever they announced that they were making the iPad Pro, a big iPad, which is this this is really big. I, I love it. If they made a bigger one, I'd do everything I could to get a bigger one just because it would be cool to have a bigger one. Um so they announced that they were going to have an iPad Pro and I said, yeah, I'm going to look into that. And when I did, I found that after some research and after some work, I discovered that I can use this for pretty much everything. And that's part of what I want to have in the channel. So I want to start by making a video about how I'm doing this. So here's, here is what I have. First of all, I've got the iPad Pro. And this iPad Pro is... The, it's actually the it, it has it does not have cellular on it, but it's tricked out all the way. I got 120 is it 128 megs? I think it's 128 gigs, I think. And I got a got a cover because a cover is good to have because you want to be able to stand it up from time to time like this. And rather than buy um, you know the more expensive keyboard, I decided to get this guy. And this now you see the lights in the way or it's in the way of the light. This is by Arctech. I think it costs nineteen dollars now. It cost me twenty-four to begin with. It's it's rechargeable. It lasts about three months, and it connects via Bluetooth. That's nice. Now I want to explain something about the Bluetooth because it turns out that you can have Bluetooth with multiple devices. Now I've I've never tried this with my other iPad but I can have the Apple Pencil which connects by, via Bluetooth and that keyboard at the same time so you get your Apple Pencil and you're good and I got my Apple Pencil because you know why try and use something else Apple built this thing it I do not have battery problems with it I it's you know, people, some people complain about it it it's fine with it, it's been fine for me so I'm I'm not here to review this stuff I want to show how I'm doing it Okay, so, and yes, that's Saitama, so anybody who wonders, I actually drew this myself. Uh, in fact, that might be what I bring up. I'll bring this bring this up. Maybe I will, I don't know. Um, but what I, but, but, um, gotta move on. So, these are the apps that I like to use, okay? Now, everybody ought to have manga pose. I don't know if that can be seen in the video or not, but Manga Pose is just a... a instead of having... Uh, I'm serious about I want to use the iPad Pro for everything. So if you've got a, a funky pose or a funky camera angle and you can't figure out how to draw a figure, it's good to have that. And I think, if I remember right, it costs $6.99. I think that's a lot cheaper than it would be if you were on Windows. So there you go. Then there's this, my script editor, Celtics. I think it's called that, Celt. Kelt, it could be Kelt X, it could be that. Um, there is a, there, well, let me just show you. There is a, a setting in here for doing your, like, see how it says panel one, or page one, panel one. And then you can do a comic script right in, right in it, so that's good to have. I love that. It's good. But then come the workhorses. There's Medibang, and when I open Medibang, or open... Oh good, it says recover one. So now it's going to open up something. And guess what that looks like? That looks just like Manga Creator. And it works a lot like Manga Creator, so you can get that. And and that's free, by the way. And Procreate costs $6.99. And this was what I had open just a second ago. 
And this was the feature that convinced me that it was the, it, this is, yeah, I needed to have this. Because you can turn this page all over the place and control it. It's just awesome. I love it. Love it. And everybody ought to love it. Now, this works a lot like, this is my workhorse app for, for doing stuff. I did this, actually I did this quite a few months ago, just learning how all the bits and pieces work together. And, except for this. This was added in Medibang. I'll show you that later. But, um, it works just like Photoshop, right? Here are your layers and such, so that you can do, you know, you can do whatever it is you've got to do. And except that everything is on top instead of it being buried inside of like if you got to get different pens and stuff that's right here so there's there's different kinds of pens different kinds of pencils all sorts of different kind of brushes that you might need you can you can uh, change them if you want change the settings on them save different versions of it like I have technical pen modified down here for a different function um, it is just, and I could rename that if I wanted to. And I can change the sizes of it over here on this side. Open the gallery and such. Do what it is that you got to do. In fact, let's open the gallery and let's see if I have something that's got a lot of stuff in it. Like this is page two of of my manga. You've seen the name of it. I'm not going to say much more about it. See now this is sort of the finished page two. I may add stuff to this later. In fact I think that maybe there's not enough stuff on this wall back here but yeah we'll see. Um, but this is it handles lots of lots of layers but I haven't actually used a lot of layers here or maybe I have. Looks like a lot of layers. But this is what it is that I'm using in order to do this and I'm just making this video to see if I can make a video um, because I'm also going to use my iPads I don't know if it's this one or the other iPad it just depends on how I feel about it um, probably use the, the one that I'm using to record it with I'll take a photograph at some point and maybe put that in to the video so that you can see how my little setup looks here so so Hope to make some more videos like this, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.